Now it's that time in the Sports Center for Dome News. In the Minneapolis Metrodome, officials say 49 new lights will be installed to illuminate the gray fabric ceiling that currently obscures pop flies in certain places. They say that the contract to install the lights was signed a couple of weeks ago. Does not, repeat, does not come as a result of the, uh, all the protests filed this week by the New York Yankees. The work should be done by the July 16th All-Star Game. The Pontiac Silverdome will have to find a new insurance company before the storm-damaged arena can meet its anticipated August reopening date. The Silverdome's current insurance company fired off a 90-day notice cancellation about two weeks after the roof, the roof collapsed during the March 4th snowstorm. And now to the Superdome. A Louisiana State House committee gave its approval to a 21-year lease that would keep the New Orleans Saints in the Superdome under local ownership. The agreement between the state and new Saints owner Tom Benson includes $2.6 million in concessions from the state and the Superdome.